Hi guys, PJ here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to move the radio on the Mitsubishi Pizero. This particular one is a 2007 and I'm also going to show you a fitting kit for a normal Pizero radio, which is this. This one's made by a company called Connects 2 and it's the full fitting kit. It's a fascia and a wiring harness for normal wired stereos, not amplified stereos, okay? This is a CT24MT05-2 and as you can see it's a Shogun Pizero. In this kit you will receive fascia like a plastic adapter to make the dashboard the right shape there you go, little clips on the back there and a wiring adapter like so with the Pajero plug on one end CT20 MT03 normal ISO plugs on the other end now then first things first to get the radio out you're going to need a trim removal tool, something like this or a flat one. These are available eBay, Amazon, they're about a pound. Don't use a screwdriver, guys, you'll probably damage your trim. And we're going to lever off these plastic surrounds. Now, this particular vehicle looks like somebody's quite ham-fistedly had a go at this in the past. When you lever these out, you've got to be careful you don't snap this front fascia away from the grill. Okay, so basically it just sort of pops all the way around. Normally work at the top here as well. Oops, Daisy. Yeah, you, you hear the click. We we'll go around it, easy it out, and then draw it forward. There's the item removed. So it's got plastic lugs. Look, look, click it in. And as I was saying, somebody's been really ham fisted with this in the past. Look, they broke all the little lugs that hold the other sides broken as well that hold this air vent to it. So it's just basically falling apart. Duplicate this on the other side and remove the other air vent. This is the other side vent, and as you can see, yes, also smashed. Somebody's not been careful when they've been taking it apart. They do just click into these holes, so they are quite delicate. You've got to be careful. There we go, there's another smashed one there, look. That one's not too bad. Now we're on to the main trim surround, which is basically a push fit. So in other words, normally you've got a bit of a bit of foot. Oh, actually, no, this one's falling out, so it's obviously been out quite a few times. So we ledge that there. Okay, pull that forwards. Okay, now that gives access to the main screws that hold the radio in, just here. Phillips screws, got those each side to take out. And also, this unit here will need to be removed and put onto your new fascia. It's held in with four screws, one, two, three, four. So you basically unbolt that and put it on your new one. So what I'm gonna do is move this out of the way so we can actually unscrew the stereo. The top unit removed out of the way, it's got a little press plug look for the wiring, you just press the button down and pull the plug out so you can remove the whole assembly out of the way. Here's the rear of this particular stereo, we're going to need to unplug all of this stuff. Like I was saying, this one unfortunately has been messed with, so it's not a great example, but I just want to show you the basics guys of how you remove the radio on this, it's pretty straightforward. I'll just show you the upper section. So this is your dashboard upper section, yeah, normally sits like that with the radio. On the rear, there you go, you've got one, two, three, four, and that whole thing screws into the new fascia. And guys, that's it. That's uh, how to get the radio out of a Mitsubishi Pajero. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again next time. Bye for now.